What's going on y'all? Here I am back with another banger. So today we finna get the body work done. As you can see, my core panels all chewed up and beat. But my boy, he lived close to me. He finna get it done right. I just gotta take it to him right here, right here. We can go over a little bit more when I get there. But now my boy follow me over there. And uh, yeah, my shit over here on flat. Let me give y'all boys a cold start. That tire feels sketchy as hell. Other than that, this boy's solid. The more we got the music playing, gutted life, feel me? Yeah, we're gonna be there soon. It's down the street. I'm finna fill up with some gas. All right, so we have landed to our destination. Check out this, uh, these old schools you got. You got this old, uh, what is this, Trans Am? And then you got like, uh, let's see, let me see. He got a Chevelle with a big, with a, with, no, with a 383 or something like that in it, a uh, stroke 350. And you got this, I think it's a Nova, and then you got this uh, Z28 Camaro, pretty sweet. Hopefully one day, one of these days, you can get the charger and the hoist and hope my shit don't fall apart. It's like, nah, but yeah, I don't want to get it up there. But yeah, so let's get this body with rolling. I'm gonna try to record as much as I can, but like I'm just dropping the car off and getting that, getting that shit done. Just paying the money and call, call it a day. Hi y'all, uh, so it's the next day, and I done found some more pieces to the puzzle. I found some clean fenders, well, I hope they clean. I found them on a uh, Facebook Marketplace. I just need the two front fenders, a rear bumper, and some side skirts, but uh, these fenders are supposedly clean and they're already off, so I'm about to just go pick them up. And then the rear bumper and the side skirts, I'll just, uh, I don't know, buy some, buy some from you, pull. I'll just go and take them off. Uh, I'm easy, and I'm pretty sure there's some clean ones up there. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna pick them up and then we're gonna go put them on. So the whole car can be looking. And we're gonna get a little update on it, see how, see how it's doing. It's only been a day though, so I don't really expect them. That champion out of parts. Yeah, they is. They dirty as hell, but it's straight. That ain't nothing but a thing. Got a little scuffs and shit. It got one little ding right here, but I ain't even sure about that. Oh, got this little plastic shit. I don't even know what that is or what, but yeah, they cool. I'm gonna go ahead and pick them up. Throw them on the car. I'm gonna just sand down the little edges and shit. And I don't know. And they're white, so that's a good. Even though the car ain't gonna stay white. See how the scat coming along. She coming along good. He got that. He like cut this. Well, he he cut the rest of the metal out. And what did uh, oh whoa whoa and a new piece off a different car. Got the nice all welded up. He also went ahead and got me some more little pieces that I need and shit. Like I got these are the fenders. I said I still need to throw them on, but that shit could wait. Got me uh, some side skirts and some front fender liners and some rear fender liners. I don't know where those at, but everything gonna be nice and covered up. The only thing I need for the body after that is a rear bumper, cause this little crack right here gonna drive me gonna drive me crazy. That tiny little crack ruins everything, but it's straight. This side he got this little piece nice and nice and uh fixed i just need this little piece down here and after that i'm gonna grind down the little rockers and just paint them you want to say something to them i just gotta move the car forward we're gonna start up that chevelle we just oh uh, yeah that out. my boy josh on the spot big chevelle
383. I see you got the front end on it, like the lights and shit. Yeah. It's starting to look good. Yeah, bitch. Hell yeah. Those stroker motors. Hell yeah. A big, what is it, a 383? Oh, mm -hmm. Hell yeah, that bitch sound nice crazy. Man, fucking big carb. Hell yeah. That bitch sound crazy. As y'all see my boy Josh ain't playing no games. He got my shit up here on the hoist. My thing, my shit over here a rust bucket, but he, he got this shit nice. I already showed y'all that, but he got this bottom piece nice and wetted up. It looks good. Um, I had to look under, and there's some O2 sensors unplugged on my shit. It should I plug them in? But uh. My boy, no, you ever been on some back watch? Let's go show on your truck right quick. So there's some exclu exclusive content. I haven't even, bro, I didn't even drop the other video on the right of the line. Dude. Oh, okay, yeah, that was, he had got a red, a red 5.3 step side, short bed, everything. But that bitch gone. The only thing this team has is rough. Ah. I mean, one little spot right there, rockers. That ain't none, though. I see showing the miles on this bitch. Shit. Clean ass interior. Hell yeah, this is mint. My boy, no, you're raping this bitch. Sweet. Sixty-eight thousand original miles. Oh, this year. Oh, I'm Pop the hood. The only downfall, we we bought this bitch thinking it was a a, a five three. We bought it. Boy, this bitch a four eight. What'd it say right there? Or what did, what did it say the 4 8 shit at? 4.8 liters. This bitch a 4.8, but for those miles, you can't even complain. This bitch is clean as hell. It was like, it was like grandpa owned for real, because bro was old as hell. Dude, it's a, it's a 4x4. Oh, dude, it got the original window sticker. All the paperwork and shit, a little crispy ass book and shit. All the receipts and manuals and everything. I'm gonna go show them all your, your other trucks right quick. Now, anyway, this, this exclusive for real, for real. If y'all really watch my videos, y'all seen this truck. The tr this is the blue truck that we put the TBSS seats in. This is that one right here. And look where it's at now. This died last month. What happened, bro? This died. There was a slight inconvenience on the highway. And this bitch, uh, it did a few little rolls. It rolled about four times. But, uh, yeah, here she is. If anybody was wondering where the truck is, she's here and she's parted out. And there ain't shit left in it. But shit, this bitch still runs. In, well, it don't drive, but it runs, though. It still got the, the long tube headers and all the goodies on it. And it still got little miles, all that. No cap. Built trans. Five, strong 5.3. Friends, look at this bitch. Roller. We had went to Ohio to pick this up. That's but uh, 50 bucks, uh -huh, 50 bucks get you a roller because my boy know it and gave up on <laughs> it. Hell yeah. This bitch a manual transmission. Look, it has like a, what's, I forgot what the trans call. No, 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 let me, let me get to that. It got drop shackles. Take the drop shackles off if you yeah, sell it. Drop shackles, I'm gonna take whatever I can. The shocks, the shocks still good. They're like oh, hydraulic or whatever. Sad. I need this bar. Oh, wait, that was for the other red truck. I need this. Oh, yeah, that red truck. Oh. Yeah, I put the interior in. This is the interior from that oh. truck, but I got to take it back out. Radio for sale. SS, SS airbag for sale. Everything for sale for the right price. Wheels for sale. Shit, hell yeah. Here's the trucks. This uh come get the shit for free. The little Sierra. Post it up. Whole bunch of parts and shit, whole bunch of junk. We got one side of a uh, cat eye headlights, none. These OEM step side tails, these are rare as hell, 20 bucks. It's like now I don't know how much they go for it, but they, we got this uh, grill, cat eye. All this shit junk though, huh? To be honest. Now nah, I got it needs a motor. Yeah, so I got word that the scat charger is done. So I just put it right now to pick it up. Let's see how it's looking. Yeah, so I got the scat charger. 
so I didn't really record much of me picking it up. But here she is. Here's the finished product. Looks good. I ain't got to worry about no more rust, no chopped up ass quarter panels or none of that. As you can see, it looks nice and smooth. I just got like wet sand and shit down here. Bro, the only thing that's pissing me off right now is this uh the old e-brake cable. Because when I bought the car, like whoever swapped it, uh, they just cut that shit. And it'd be dragging on the floor and smelling nasty and all types of shit. But put a new gas cap on it because the old one I had was all rusty and ugly and shit. It's blue. But uh, I'm gonna wrap it, or I don't know, I'm gonna wrap it or paint it. But uh, I need a new rear bumper as well, like I was telling y'all, because that shit bogus. And on this side, he was in a new piece, and it looks good. But I want to send it down so I can get the byline more, more, I don't know, more better, I guess. But yeah, here she is. Let me know in the comments below if I should wrap or paint the car. I don't know, like, what I want to do yet. But. That's going to be the end of this video. So, let me know what y'all think of the bodywork being done. Like, finally, she's getting somewhere. But, uh, yeah, stay tuned for more content. Next video is going to be a banger. Like, y'all ain't finna have to worry about seeing this ugly-ass front end no more. Or none of that shit. This is an ugly wheel setup or none of that. But, uh, yeah, let me know what y'all think. Like, comment, subscribe. I'll catch you on the next one.